Hi everyone, welcome to the Ford Nation YouTube video part two. Today we're going to talk about a number of issues. The amount of money I tried to save at City Council, some was successful, some was not. We're going to talk about the election coming up on October 27th, explain how you become a candidate, and I am personally going to name some names of people that I want defeated in the next election. And I'll let Doug talk about a number of things that uh, people are questioning about building a business. Um, my brother Doug here started Deco Labels in Chicago, in New Jersey, but I'll let him tell you the story. Um, we had to work for every single dime that we had. When my dad was alive, he said, you want allowance, you go up and work. So we're going to get into some of the stories and tell you a little bit about our side of the story and tell you a little bit about the Ford family. What do you think, Doug? Well, the reason we, we're doing this, folks, for the YouTube, we, we have a, a biased media. We've talked to media all over the world, and they've never, ever seen a biased uh, media against the mayor, against myself, against our family, anywhere in the world. As they tell me, it's unprecedented. But the difference is, folks, the people out there are smarter than the media. The media will try to twist it, angle it every which way they can to make sure they put their little spin on the story and uh but guess what media the people are too smart they see right through all your shenanigans and we we're straight shooters and we're going to tell you way, the way it is today okay well i'm going to drop the gloves and get right to it october 27th is the election uh, let me explain how easy it is to become a candidate if you're a canadian citizen you're over the age of 18 that's all, and you live in Toronto, that's all you have to do is go down to City Hall and pay $100. Again, you're a Canadian citizen, you're over the age of 18, and you live in Toronto, go down and pay $100 at City Hall, and your name goes on the ballot. So let me tell you the top 10 councillors that I want to see defeated, in no particular order. And if I don't mention their name, doesn't mean that I don't want them defeated. <laughs> don't <As> be you, offended. <laughs> don't We're still be, coming after you, don't worry. <laughs> every single one of them, except for maybe five, um, Frank DiGiorgio, Francis Nunziata, Vince Crisante, um, my brother, Doug Ford, and I think that's pretty well it. Let's say four. And Anthony Pruzza, um, although he doesn't vote with us sometimes, he supported me when times are tough. But let me tell you who we have to defeat. All they do is tax and spend and increase taxes. I, we need candidates to run against Gord Perks at High Park. Janet Davis in East York, Adam Vaughn downtown, Joe Mahavik in Midtown, Sarah Doucette in High Park, Shelley Carroll in Don Valley, Glenda Bearmaker in Scarborough, Mike Layton downtown, Kristen Wong Tam downtown, Paul Ainsley in Scarborough. He was the only one who voted against the subway in Scarborough. Folks, there's many other people. Josh Matlow, Mary Margaret McMahon, Chin Lee, Raymond Cho. There's other people that are also very vulnerable, like the Fletchers and the Fillions and the Audrey and the Lindsay Lubies, that all they want to do is trash us. Well, folks, there are people that have registered, but don't get discouraged. If you want to run, please register, and we will help you in any way we can to run your campaign and guide you down the right path. If you want to run as a school trustee, same thing. All you have to do is pay $100, be over the age of 18, a Canadian citizen, and live in Toronto. Um, why am I doing this? Because enough is enough. These people have gone out of their way to, I personally think, ruin Toronto, increase taxes, strip me of my powers, and you know what? It's time to put up or shut up. And I've had enough of it. So um, they wanted the war, they're gonna get the war. Um, what do you think of those that list? Uh, they, they are your buddies? I guess well, you know, your lefty buddies. Are, you know, and these tell, you, people tell you the truth, Rob. As I've always said, uh, you know, we've tried to cut down council from forty-four to twenty-two, but it's like asking the turkeys to vote for Thanksgiving. And uh, these folks, they're in there for the job. They're in there to feather their own nest. A lot of these councillors down there, and we're there to protect the taxpayers. You notice all those people you uh, you just mentioned, plus plus many more. Um, folks, if you want to run an efficient government, if you want to run an efficient business, you can't give us a bunch of yahoos down there that have never met a payroll in their life 